pillow come along with us to grant's farm in st louis missouri just so you know the admission is free but parking does cost you can purchase it separate online and it's a little cheaper they have a large gift shop that has lots of things you can buy and then you get on a tram and you go for a ride see some historic sites as well as lots and lots of animals some of them actually get pretty close to the tram but obviously we're not supposed to touch them it was really interesting to see those my daughter loved that then we get to the other part of Grant's farm where there is a carousel and you can uh, feed the baby goats with bottles they were a little aggressive just fyi my daughter kind of was a little nervous with that down the way we could feed the adult goats um, and down a little further the goats were not quite as aggressive so my daughter liked those quite a bit more We bought a package uh, that included like the goat feed and a snack. Then you could go in this bird house and you purchase these little feeding sticks. Some of the birds were a little aggressive, so my daughter was kind of nervous, but she enjoyed it nevertheless. Then we saw the swans and the ducks and the peacocks. There was one peacock that was really on full display there. They have lots of different types of animals in these cages. That was entertaining. Uh, some camels and then some lemurs and they also have a show uh, where they show lots of different animals and different talents that they have and skills there's a goat here uh, that has an f on the side of her she's kind of famous <laughs> this is the little popsicle that they get and then you can get up close and personal with the cows. You can actually even touch them and pet them if you'd like. And then over here is a beer garden. You can get snacks and beer and then you can look at the historic things. Um, they didn't have any Clydesdales, but we did get to see some of the other horses, which was fun.